Hello everybody, my name is Agent Chiteyas and welcome to my tutorial on how to play LEGO Universe. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your internet launcher, like whatever you use. I'm going to use Google Chrome personally, but use whatever. Firefox is a good option. Uh, internet Explorer sucks butt, so uh, don't do, don't use that, but I mean, that's my opinion. Alright, now go to lunaserver.com. Once the page loads, uh, you can see there's a lot of cool stuff on here. It says answer the call, save imagination. Um, just a lot of cool stuff. Go to the download link in the top is right, and then just click on it. Now go to the top part on the client, like under the client section, that is called Nexus 2. And uh, you're going to download the torrent file. It is the very top one on the list. You're just going to click on it to download it. Alright, so that should download, but to open this torrent file, you're going to need some kind of torrent opener. Um, I personally am going to use uTorrent for this uh, tutorial. Choose to use whatever you want. uTorrent, uh, just search uTorrent like that, and then click on it. And then you're simply, once this it comes up, you're just going to press the free download there. It's going to be already set for whichever launcher you have, like if, I mean, operating system, like if you have Mac or Windows or Linux. It'll uh, download for that, like whatever it is. Uh, please keep in mind that this works best on Windows, like this entire um, tutorial. It's just I'm using Mac because I personally have a Mac, and uh, I've found a way to make it work. So when the uTorrent installation has finished, press close, and then you're just going to simply open uTorrent, or it might open automatically depending on uh, what settings you chose while you're editing it. Alright, so when it opens, all you're going to simply do is you're going to, um, you're going to find where you downloaded your, uh, Luna server thing to. It's most likely going to be in your computer downloads, like wherever you, uh, downloaded the Nexus 2 file to. And you're going to simply just drag it into uTorrent. Now here's the download. Uh, please keep in mind that this will take a good 15 minutes. So if it's taking, like, a really long time, that is normal. That's what's going to happen. So wait for the 15 minutes for it to completely install before doing the next step. Alright, so when it's finished installing, Find where you chose the download torrent to go, it's probably just going to be like wherever you chose I guess. Uh, and you're going to double click on the dot .zip. This also takes a really good 15 minutes or more, so this is a time lapse of it downloading, but it really takes a very very long time in actuality, it's like insane. Uh, keep in mind that this uh, game is about 10 gigabytes worth of uh, stuff, like of gameage. So uh, that's something to keep in mind, it's, it, it is 10 gigabytes, so yeah. Alright, when that's finished downloading, double click on the Nexus 2 to open it, and then uh, go into Client, the Client folder, you're going to open that up, and then you're going to find the file, uh, it's in the top right, called boot.config, cfg.cfg, uh, and you're going to open that, I'm personally using TextEdit, it doesn't matter, just open that with whatever software you have, and now I'm going to show you the two pretty much most important steps to this entire thing, I'm going to be teaching you, um, how to like actually connect to a server because the actual LEGO Universe servers are of course down. Uh, so to do this you're going to go to lunaserver.com again. And this is because at the very bottom, so scroll to the very bottom of the website and then click on uh, Johnny Server. It's small, it's under public servers and you're not going to have an account so you're not going to be able to log in. So register an account, this is just like an example, just put in a username, make sure it's original, you know, don't be Mr. Uh, Charles Dickens over here, um, enter your email, password, repeat password, click on the recaptcha, um, and then you're just gonna have to, you're gonna have to go to your email and actually click on the verification email to, for it to work, and once you've created an account, uh, you can continue on to the next step. So this is the most important part in your boot.config file, uh, find where it says, uh, auth, server IP equals zero and delete the whole entire thing after the two dots the colon uh, the whole entire thing up to the comma leave the comma and you're going to put this in instead you're going to enter in lu, lu 
dot Johnny dot oh no lu dot Johnny VPS dot de all right and then there's one more edit in the bottom left you're gonna find local you're gonna delete the zero now this changes it to English because you're not gonna want to read this in German I mean if you do leave it uh, and you're gonna enter an e n underscore u s but this won't work uh, on its own now you have to enter in a colon right before the local there just enter in a colon and this should work fine I'm doing it right here just that's that's it took me a long time to figure out because all the things said it would be fine after that but you have to enter in the colon and then it should work fine go back to your client folder and open up lego uh, universe dot exe all right so it, it'll take a few moments but it is amazing uh, you're just gonna open it up it's gonna take a few seconds it's gonna turn your cursor orange it might open instantly depending on how fast your computer is and here we go so you're gonna enter in your username in the top, the one that you signed up for with Johnny. You're gonna enter in your password, it's gonna do all this stuff and say congratulations. You're gonna click next, create your character, I already have two, and you're gonna press play. Now it's gonna start you out like I'm not there because I already finished the tutorial thingy. Uh, but just to let you know that it's not completely finished, there's not NPCs or anything like that, the story's not there yet. Um, but what you're gonna do is you're just gonna walk up to Bob. And he's gonna like help you finish all the missions like he's just gonna say you finished it and teleport you to avid gardens um i believe or maybe it's a uh, nexus city or something um but you're gonna be teleported in you're gonna be there it's not like there's about a few players that play on this like there was five when i joined but uh that's a lot for like usual it's usually not very many uh, so yeah, you can enter in some basic commands, you can enter in slash flight, which allows you to fly of course, and then you can also teleport to a few different places. Uh, the teleportation codes is like slash tp1100, slash tp1200, up to around 1900 I believe, somewhere around there, so you can just teleport around, you know, explore, uh, get that nostalgia going, and yeah, so that's basically the tutorial. Thanks all of you guys for, like, just showing so much support on my LEGO Universe videos, I just thought it was so cool how many views and stuff I've been getting, how many likes, how many of you have actually, like, been giving me good feedback. I had the, um, owner of Johnny Server, which is the one I'm playing on, actually leave me a comment, and, uh, somebody that owns another server called, like, Luna Server Reborn, which he's actually got some NPCs, but it was down when I tried to join. Uh, this one's up, like, 99% of the time is what it says, so you should be able to join... It is really cool, you just check everything out, you know. Uh, so if this did work, please like this video. And if you have any questions on anything that I went over in this video, uh, I understand that it's a bit complicated to do. Um, but if you have any questions, if it's not working, please leave a comment and I will answer like as soon as possible, which will probably be a good like 10 or 15 minutes. I mean, if you comment at midnight, it'll take the next day. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you. In the next video, goodbye!